what we found is, um, and just to, to contrast education level from the school quality um, uh, piece. Uh, so what we found is that there is an effect of uh, school quality um, on outcomes and uh, for uh, women, um, black and white women, that was independent of uh, actual years of education. Years of education only um, uh, accounted for, uh, it, it only explained part of the fact that, you know, people who attend higher quality uh, schools end up getting more, uh, end up having better cognitive outcomes later in life. Um, and so I, I think that, uh, you know, if you think about what uh, uh, what what ed- years of education does, right? We know that in the literature, this is uh, talked about a lot about the positive effects in years of education. You know, uh, it can those effects can be through cognitive reserve. Your brain is constantly uh, exercising, built. Um, you know, more neural connections that could provide a buffer from neurological insult. Um, but education also opens the door to, um, uh, you know, a cascade of uh, other social um, uh, opportunities. So, you know, uh, occupational status, um, income, um, different things that, that then provide, um, you know, access to, to, to different material uh, goods that, that help promote better health, but then um, as a result, affect late life cognitive health. And so uh, with quality of education, we're seeing that in addition to those effects of, um, of uh, educational attainment, quality of education is, is providing even more. And so it could be, again, that, that attending a school with higher quality of education not only led to some people achieving more education, but it also opened up uh, other doors for them, um, you know, different uh, other social connections that helped them climb the SES ladder. 